Morning folks, I'm Tony from Gagnon's Mountain Homestead. Welcome back to the mountain. As you can see, it's getting a little chilly around here. Winter's setting in. That's what happens up here in New England. Uh, what we got going today is uh, we got some dirt coming in. As you can see over there, our little road's a little bit wet. And that's where we're moving the tiny house through. So we got some gravel coming in today. We're going to make a little road so we can move the tiny house. I'll show you where we're going to do that. You saw me coming down from over there and then we come through there and then it turns up here and this is where the tiny house is going up through here and it probably looks smooth on the camera but it's not and then up through this area there's a rock wall that goes along there and we broke through that there but we're gonna have to smooth that out so I want some gravel in there because pulling the tiny house through here is just going to be kind of a pain. So right now, the uh, driver should be here soon with our gravel. And then we'll go ahead and we'll have them dump it out here. Because not only do we have to fill in back there, but you see all this mud here. We have to fill this in too. So that's all going to be filled in with gravel. And then I also want to fill in... See, there's a tiny house. It was here. We moved it to there so he can get the dump truck through. And then in front of our barn here, we got mud here, too. We want to fill some of that in, too. From the other direction, it looks like this. And as you can see, it's kind of wet. Fill that in, fill that in, bring the tiny house back there so it's out of my yard for the winter. So, we'll see you when the dump truck gets here. All right, folks, here comes the dirt. He's going to come about as far back as he feels comfortable with. Because he's kind of heavy. And we don't want him sinking in the mud. I don't think my little coyote could pull him out. Hung up on that tree. All right, load one. Gonna have at least one more coming. Now I gotta get to work moving it around.
Okay, so we got this dirt behind us now, and we're going to start filling in some of that mud with the tractor there, and uh, so we can get out back there with the tiny house. Let's get going. Comes road number two. Ooh, that's still soft. There it is, load number two. More work to do. Hey, right, Joey? Hey.
I tell you what folks, after a lot of work, we got it done. I sure did miss our little coyote here. She's back. Anyway, so this was all mud through here. We got that done. This was all the mud. Well, we, this is where the dump truck had backed up in. So we got this all covered up. This was that big mud hole. It's no longer a mud hole. And we got the road coming out here. So the tiny house will be coming up through here. And we got where all those rocks were. That's all covered up nicely now. So we should be able to pull that tiny house up through here pretty good. This should all work nicely. We got this all done up through here. And the tiny house will be going in that clearing over there. All in all, pretty good. Not bad. For a day's work of spreading with the little coyote there. She does all right. I'm happy with it. Sure did miss it. So there we go. So it's still a little soft through here, but this will all pack down, freeze up a bit. It was pretty wet and muddy. But we got that pretty good right there. All right. Hope you enjoyed that. So there you go, folks. There's yet another video. Uh, we'll be moving the tiny house soon. Uh, not sure exactly when. This is kind of got to harden up a bit before we can move it. Uh, so I hope you enjoyed that. I hope you like my videos. You can subscribe, give us a thumbs up, tell your friends and your neighbors about it. And as always, folks, God bless. Oh, folks, and I got to know, hat, yes or no? Let me know in the comments. Thanks.